Singapore. We are hosting our first ever female lacrosse camp where we're introducing females to lacrosse for the first time or returning female athletes who would like to come and spend some time on the floor with other girls. For female lacrosse players in Saskatchewan, moments like these are rare. An entire afternoon dedicated to learning the sport alongside other girls and women. What's happening with female lacrosse is our other provinces have developed and moved ahead and now we would like to catch up. So the seed is planted, um, it's in a nourishing environment for female lacrosse and we would like for our females to come out and join. Darcy Rat is the first ever women's sector chair for the Saskatchewan Lacrosse Association. Have you done it before girls? Okay, so ready? While never a player herself, Rat became more involved with the SLA when her then 12-year-old daughter said she'd like to try. And we kind of went, really? She said, yeah, my brother's play. So she started out as a goalie for the first year and took them to the final. Just line up right there. Since then, Annika Ratt has become passionate about lacrosse, joining multiple teams over four years and traveling where opportunity takes her. I've been to Toronto and Ontario. I played with a team over in BC, which also played in Ontario area in Six Nations, which lacrosse is huge there and it was phenomenal being there. Are you playing, Alina? Today, the 16-year-old is helping teach lacrosse basics, lead drills, and instill confidence in other girls who want to play. It's really intimidating to be like the only girl like a lot of these girls too have been the only girl like not all female teams so it's nice to gather them all females and kind of hype each other up just like the players for parents it was their first time at an all-female lacrosse camp Mackenzie's always played with all boys so she's really one of the only girl players in Moose Jaw now so we're excited to play with girls and hopefully maybe there'll be an opportunity for her in the future to play with girls that's exactly what the SLA would like to see, with the goal to put forth its first all-female provincial team. Right now, the most common option for girls in Saskatchewan is joining a co-ed team. Our idea behind our camp is that the girls could come out, learn the knowledge, learn the vocabulary, learn some of the skills that would be used for tryouts, and feel more comfortable walking into that atmosphere without feeling like they don't belong there. Outside Regina, the SLA also held all-female tri-lacrosse clinics in Saskatoon and Prince Albert, introducing new athletes to the game and each other. All the girls were really nice and encouraging towards everyone, and I got worked up a sweat, so that was really nice. Yeah, it was just lots of fun. Thanks for coming. Thank you for having me up.